Hi, I'm Jake from Magic Toolbox and I'm going to walk you through adding Magic Zoom Plus to your WYSIWYG Web Builder website. This is Magic Zoom Plus in action. You can zoom and you can click to enlarge. Right, the first thing is to download the free trial. It's downloaded. Let's open the location and unzip it. Okay, there are your files. Save to wherever you chose to save them. Let's head over to WYSIWYG Web Builder and go down to File Publisher and drag that over. Double click it, add a folder, find the, the main folder where the Matic Zoom Plus JavaScript and CSS files are. There it is. There's also some graphics in there. And in they come. OK. The next thing to do is add an image. Drag that in. We're going to put the main image on the page, which is a Harley bike. And we're going to right-click the bike and link to the large image. And that's done. So we've got a link in place. Now we need to add inside the anchor a class of Magic Zoom Plus. And that will tell the page to activate Magic Zoom Plus when we hover over the bike. So the final thing we need to do is go to page HTML and inside the head tags we are going to copy the the text that you need to link to the Magic Zoom Plus JavaScript and CSS files. All right, those are the, the lines we need. I'm just copying and pasting it because it saves time. So yeah, so you've got two lines here. The first line links to the CSS and the second line links to the JavaScript. You might need to change these locations if you've saved it somewhere else. Okay, let's preview that. And there you have it, Magic Zoom Plus is working. The next thing we're going to try is to edit the parameters. So on that same page, the integration page for Magic Zoom Plus, scroll down to the bottom and you'll see over 70 different parameters that you can use to customize Magic Zoom just how you want it. We will add a zoom fade. That's a nice effect which uh, adds in a, a fade at the beginning and end of the zoom. So right click, go to the HTML, inside the anchor, add a rel tag and put zoom fade in there and set it to true. OK that and preview. And as you hover over the bike, the zoom window fades in and fades out. OK, what else should we add? Let's go up here and, yeah, let's add the zoom width. We'll increase it from the standard width of 300 pixels. And we'll set it to 500 pixels. Back in the HTML, go to the anchor, semicolon, zoom width, set to 500. OK that, and preview. And there you can see that the zoom has got wider. And the last thing we're going to add is we're going to give it a coloured background for when it enlarges. So background opacity. The background colour is going to be black. That's set by default. Opacity is normally zero, so it's effectively not working. So we're going to set opacity to 80. So back to the bike. Right click it. Go to HTML. Inside the anchor. And add background opacity of 80%. OK it. Preview. Click it. And there you have it. The background has gone to 80% black opacity. So that's it. You've installed Magic Zoom Plus on your WYSIWYG website.